rainbow just arrived. Hi guys, I'm Sean Cousins. I'm the owner of CrossFit Bodie on Sydney's Northern Beaches and I've been a try-hard CrossFit athlete for six years now. Uh, hey, I'm Kim Peterson. I am 32 years old. I work for Alphabet and I train a Reebok CrossFit Gold Coast. Kim, I don't really like Kim. No, Kim's, uh, Kim's a lot of fun to be around. He's uh, easy to talk to and very knowledgeable about this sport of CrossFit. He's, uh, he's not scared to question the, the social norms that go around this sport. He's, uh, he's very accomplished in the sport. He's been to regionals twice, one of them going to the games and competing for CrossFit Athletic, and, uh, and always in good spirits too. The, uh, the only time I've ever seen him angry is when he's hungry. And uh, this trip, my main goal is to just keep him well fed. After that, I think we'll get along. All right, Sean. I'm just learning some new things about Sean. One, his farts are horrendous. And two, he's a lot worse talking in front of the camera than what I was hoping for when I roped him into this road trip. Uh, but other than that, we do get along quite well. He, um, he has a very similar passion about CrossFit that I do. And I think that's one of the reasons why we kind of came up with this idea to do the road trip together. He can talk about CrossFit in a very passionate and interesting way, which I like because uh, I can easily get bored about CrossFit because it's such a big part of every aspect of my life, like work and training. Uh, but he makes it really interesting and uh, uh, we tend to like, have these big chats about stats and athletes and gyms and what training is good training and what training is not good training. Uh, and he just makes it interesting. So uh, these two weeks, I think it's gonna be fun. So me and Sean has had this idea to go on a road trip for a long time. We've been so lucky that we've gotten to know a lot of the people in the community and we're looking at the map, we thought Adelaide to Brisbane, just visit as many gyms and, and athletes as we can. It sounds like a perfect plan for summer. Okay, 8th of December, we're in Adelaide. I flew in from the Gold Coast, Sean flew in from Sydney. Uh, we just arrived here at the airport, just got my luggage and we're gonna get a cab and then go to James Huber's gym, CrossFit Mode. Uh, we don't have our car yet, we're gonna pick it up tomorrow. Uh, we don't have our equipment yet uh, either, so we're gonna pick that up tomorrow. Hopefully all that will work itself out. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna get a cab and then uh, head to the gym. Hey. Not a lot. How are you? I'll shake my hand, I'm trying to clean them. What have you done? Oh, I've covered them in bloody floorboard polish. Are you cleaning the gym for us? Yeah, yeah, we've got to make it look nice. <laughs> so what's an all-time PR? Uh, 152 and a half, I got that two days ago. Okay. And you don't want to go for that now? You want to go 150 first? We'll go 150 and if I get it, then we'll hit 155. Oh, when, oh, get oh, when I get it? Yeah, yes. I'll get it. Good work! Yeah. So James. Hi, I'm Kayla and I'm James and we own CrossFit Mode and we're located in Adelaide CBD right at the south part of the city. Um, we've been open nine months now um, and yeah, having an absolute ball. Loving it. <laughs> I love it. Basically it started, um, I started uh, playing rugby league in Sydney um, and when I first started for a pre-season I went and um, I got introduced to CrossFit at CFX and um, from there I met I met some really cool people, met Mick Shaw, he got me involved, basically taught me everything I know and then from there um, I just got addicted and uh, I really just wanted to set up my own box. So I, um, I decided I wanted to get it all ready so I went and worked out the mines for about seven months. So I saved up some money to get the first little initial part of it going and then found a location and got knocked back on about three or four locations which I'm so glad I did because then we ended up with this place right here in town. And um, 
yeah, it's just, it started small. I thought it was amazing when I first opened um, with all the equipment that we had, but now it, just, it keeps growing and growing. And yeah, basically it's just, it's eventuated from there and it's kept growing from there. Well, we just did about every 20 to 25 seconds, we did 90% of what we just did on our jerk. Now, because we've got one round to go, we're gonna go five front squats and try and hit that one jerk. See how we go. Let's go, buddy. Come on, James. Did you want to beat him with that? Did you try to do an extra rack? Backfire. 